Carl Tanzler, a German-born radiologist in Key West, Florida during the 1930s, developed a haunting obsession with a tuberculosis patient, Elena Helen de Hoyos. Despite his efforts to cure her, she tragically died in 1931. Not only did Tanzler finance her funeral, but he also built her a mausoleum. His obsession persisted when he removed de Hoyos' body in 1933, taking it to his home and using methods like wax and plaster to preserve her remains. He lived with her corpse for seven shocking years until discovered by her sister in 1940. While the statute of limitations prevented Tanzler's conviction, his eerie fascination continued as he created a life-sized effigy of de Hoyos' face. He kept this until his death in 1952.